we had a very clear agenda. Uh, our objectives were two objectives. One, to better communicate what we're doing as GWP on climate change uh, in terms of enabling the capacity of countries uh, to contribute uh, to a global voice around the importance of water for adaptation. Uh, and also not only for adaptation, but also water as contribution to mitigation. So we have had very good interlinkages and contributions, getting voices from countries such as Zambia, where you had uh, the country delegations from the GWP country led by their local executive secretary coming to present about their work on the national adaptation, including participation in UNFCC convened events and uh, on national adaptation plan. Uh, Joseph Mbinji, the program manager from Zambia, who has been managing the GCF local project in Zambia, facilitated by GWP, uh, was here uh, meeting with UNFCCC. We had delegations also supporting our work uh, with the African Union, uh, as, uh, in particular uh, uh, the significant more key milestone event, which has been the launch of the Africa High Level Panel Water Investment Action Plan. So that was number one objective, to showcase the work we are doing from the ground, amplify our voices on water, and it was confirmed, as was said by the Prince from the Netherlands during the launch of the High Level Panel Investment Action Plan on the 2nd of December in France of other heads of state, that 90% of water uh, of adaptation is water, and we believe that as well, and we hope that the COP uh, can continue to facilitate this. We were also, uh, as part of our objective, uh, really following up with the countries to try and make sure that we give them the support they need to access climate finance by co better connecting the finance needs as well as the finances, particularly the Green Climate Fund.